Hello everyone. Let's provide the solution to this problem. x to the power of 2 multiply by x to the power of 2 equals 4 to the power of 2. Okay, so we want to deal with this problem right away. The question is what should we do? We are to solve this completely. Okay, now the first thing we're going to do is to multiply what we have um, what we have on the left. If we do that, we are going to have x to the power of 2 plus 2. Pick one of the bases and add the power since you're multiplying. So we have 4 squared, right? Good. Now from here, we can say that this is the same thing as x to the power of 4 being equal to 4 to the power of 2. But what I want to do is to apply, um, um, I want to apply difference of 2 squares. So that means I have to reduce this. So I have x squared to the power of 2. Then on the other side, we have 4 squared. Bring this to the left so we can apply our difference of 2 squares. Okay. Now, a squared minus b squared is a plus b into a minus b. So now our a is x squared, so I'll write x squared plus b, our b is 4. Then this will be in the first bracket. Then in the second bracket we have a minus b, which will be x squared minus b. What is our b? Our b is 4. This is equal to 0. Now, to continue from here, it is either x squared plus 4 is equal to 0 or x squared minus 4 is equal to 0. Right? Now, we are going to take this to the other side. Then we have x squared equals negative 4 or x squared equals positive 4. Now, to get the value of x from here, square root of x squared equals positive or negative square root of negative 4. Remember, we have to solve everything into detail, so we have to proceed with this. Then we have the same square root of x squared equal to plus or minus square root of 4. From here, we can rearrange this. So we have, by the way, this is going with this, right? So x will be equal to, x will be equal to plus or minus square root of 4 times square root of negative 1. I just picked out the negative. Or this will go with that. So we have x to be equal to plus or minus square root of 4 is 2. Now, from here, our x will be equal to plus or minus square root of 4 here is 2 times square root of negative 1 is i. Or, on this side, x is equal to plus or minus 2. Multiply this 2, so x will now be plus or minus 2i. Or, x is equal to plus or minus 2. Now, let's bring the four solutions together we have x to be equal to 2i that's x1 x2 to be equal to negative 2i right then from here i have x3 and 4 x3 to be equal to 2 yes ordinary 2 then x3 x4 now right x4 to be equal to negative 2 so these are the four solutions to the problem. But mind you, it is this and this that are the real solutions. The other two 
or the first two are imaginary solutions. Thank you for watching and if you have not subscribed to my channel, subscribe so you can get more of my videos.